Season 4 is out, and today I have an unlock all glitch for Modern Warfare 3 that will allow you to use any weapon that is locked, even if it's in the battle pass. Which means this glitch includes everybody's favorite, the Car 98K, which as of this recording is in the Season 4 battle pass. But there's no need to purchase it as long as you do this glitch before it gets patched. You can level up guns and upgrade them. You can add attachments to them once you level them up and unlock those attachments. You can pretty much use these weapons as normal, as you can see here. I don't have the shield actually unlocked, but I would was using an end game so let's get right into how you actually do this glitch so here we are in the main menu let's jump right into the requirements for this glitch now at the top left you will see a label this is my pc account the reason why i have it labeled is because you will need two players to do this glitch but before you fret it can be done with any other person regardless of if they were remote or in your house on a separate device and it's extremely easy to do so my pc account will be the friend helping you do this glitch and my xbox account will be the one actually unlocking the restricted weapon simple enough so first of all, have your friend go to the Modern Warfare 3 menu, scroll to private match, and then open up the menu and hover over training course. This is super important. The first step to this glitch is we're essentially going to be joining this game as they're joining training course, which training course, if you didn't know, is a one player lobby. So what you're gonna do on your Xbox or PlayStation 5 is you're going to click the right stick, open up your menu to view your friends, scroll over the friend that is about to click on training course and hover over join party. So you're essentially going to be joining them as they start it up. So they're gonna go ahead and click on training course now, and you're going to join as soon as the logo expands. That's how I get it 100% of the time. You can rewatch this video over and over again if you want to get the timing down. It's very easy to get the timing down. If you are too late though, just know it will say full. It'll say essentially there's too many players because again, this is a one person mode so what we're going to do now is on the xbox account we're going to click start and then we're going to click the battle pass so once you get to the battle pass you're going to notice weapons up here is displayed don't switch to it don't click anything what i want you to do is click start again and you're going to go over to your player tab now once you get over to your player tab go down to edit showcase and then you're going to click on showcase weapon this is super important just follow the steps that i do and then you're going to click swap on the weapon now you notice this one is base lock just ignore this this is a byproduct of the current glitch but what we're going to essentially be doing is you're going to now plug in your keyboard and this is the point where you click f6 twice now when you click f6 twice it's some type of keyboard shortcut for the console it's going to switch you over to classes i presume on pc this does it i'm a pc player i don't even know about this but anyway so i clicked f6 twice and it pulls up your class now you may only have to press it once but just know just pull up your class that's essentially it and what you're going to do is you're going to go in and go to the weapon that you want to unlock in this case it's the car 98k now on my friend's account on my pc account in this instance remember we're both in the same party i'm going to click start twice and it's going to go ahead and error out because again this is a one player mode you're glitched in a lobby it's not going to be able to start so you click start twice and you exit the error. Now on your Xbox, what you're gonna do is just simply click the right trigger or on your PS5, the right trigger, and then you're going to back out of that. So right trigger and then B or circle on PS5. And you're gonna notice all the weapons are selectable. Do not click anything. Don't click A, don't click anything like that. What you wanna do is hold X on Xbox or square, I presume, on PS5. Look at the bottom of your screen and make sure it says equip and open gunsmith. That is the action that you want to perform. If you did this glitch right, you should be able to pull it up. Now, keep in mind, you're going to be able to select, you know, attachments and things of that nature, because again, it's just like you're in a private match. However, the attachments will not go through just the base weapon. Now, don't fret though, because you assigning this onto your class and you can see here, I'm going to go ahead and back out. So what I want you to do just as a demonstration, and I'll explain it in a second, just click the B or circle button until you get back to this screen. You'll notice that the weapon is not the weapon that you just selected. It's not the car 98K in my case. So I'm going to go back out all the way and go over to weapons. And you'll notice in my actual class, I have the car 98 selected but it says base locked right there on the left. So it's important to remember, this is my real class and you can even see it's showing my PC account. This game is completely glitched out. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave the party completely just to demonstrate to you guys that this did in fact work. And I'm gonna go ahead and pull up my weapons tab here. 
and as you can see to its glory the car 98k is unlocked i don't need to buy the battle pass i don't need to buy black cell i don't need to play a single game in order to unlock this or any other gun that shows up now just keep in mind the only restriction for this glitch is that it works in modern warfare 3 multiplayer it's very annoying i know but that is because training course is a multiplayer mode apparently so when you go to training course obviously it is under that menu next to multiplayer warzone etc but when you back out of the battle pass menu you are immediately put into multiplayer unfortunately that's just how the game is coded so therefore it only works for this and as you can see you can do this glitch over and over again the only thing that you need to make sure that you do is that you reset each time that you do this you can only set one weapon doing this glitch and then you need to back out and essentially repeat the steps again but as you can see i do this at full speed here it is very very easy to do i'm going to go ahead and hover over whatever weapon i want you don't actually have to hover over it at this point because what you'll notice is when you pull up the filters it actually does uh it resets the ui so you can see here i have the haymaker selected well now i had the sva because it resets your ui because you're filtering them essentially but you're not actually applying anything which is super annoying anyway so i'm going to do it with the riot shield as well i'm going to go ahead and equip it it shows the fjx horus for some reason but when i go back and check my actual class what you're going to see is that i do in fact have the riot shield so that's just another quick tip for you guys make sure that you note that if you get any visual bugs just ignore them and just pay attention to what you're selecting but as you can see this shield is not unlocked this is something that i have not even used a single time i didn't go into zombies and extract with it you don't need to beg anyone to actually use this weapon you're able to use the car 98k or any other weapon with ease without doing anything just make sure that you do this glitch before it gets patched because just like the unlock all glitch in the past with attachments the unlock all attachments glitch which is now patched that they did not uh actually patch the effect they patched the method so what i mean by that is if you do this glitch and save a class with a car 98k and you never unlock it as far as like legitimately goes whenever they go and patch this which they eventually will probably very very soon just as a warning you know you're actually going to keep that class that you already assigned the car 98 to so you can see here it's set as my showcase weapon it's in my class so that custom loadout one that i just set it on is not going to lose it whenever they patch this i guarantee it guys because if they were to do that they would outrage a lot of people think about it how are they supposed to keep track of what's in your classes they can filter out everyone and then like cross reference you know database tables and say okay this person has it but they don't have it unlocked right and you know that's just a lot of work for something that does not make a difference they they're just interested in selling battle passes and making money off of players which is totally fine with me but the point i'm trying to make is is you need to make sure that you do this glitch before it gets patched now i'm going to go ahead and take this into the game just to demonstrate to you guys that it is 100 percent legit i don't want anyone questioning if or not this glitch actually works or not it 100 percent does and it's actually really really cool so it, it's a great way for you to actually try out weapons before you even go and try to unlock them so if you know you're wondering about a warzone meta loadout or something like that for a new gun like the subverter or something that you haven't used before right you don't have to actually question if or not the gun is for you you can actually go and level it up real quick especially times like right now when seasons just dropped season four just dropped so you have double xp all across the board on anything whether that be weapon xp player xp or battle pass so it's a great time for you to do a glitch like this up you know you, you kind of upgrade or, or or rather um you know level up weapons and and get attachments for weapons that you don't typically use and try it out so as you can see this alt account has terrible lobbies uh but you can see i'm actually able to use the riot shield so if you guys appreciate this video make sure you hit that like button and subscribe thank you so much for 19,000 subscribers and i will catch you in the next video